Half is the four to five choice with John Campbell driving. Five to one mouthpiece, five to one burglar, six to one Hanover Knight. Also in the contest, some double digit horses from the outside. British Asian is at 12. Cool Splash with Mike Lachance. Lachance had four winners on Saturday night. He's 25 to one in this one. Tom? And they're off. And uh, British Agent fires out. Off stride goes Mouthpiece. Mouthpiece goes on a break. And from the outside, it's Windproof. And Windproof now is up to take the lead. On the inside, Burglar is right there, matching strides with Windproof. And Burglar grabs the lead. Windproof backs off into the pocket. And Tybalt is third. British Agent is parked fourth. Rev it up fifth toward the inside. Hanover Knight is racing sixth. And it's Reuters, followed by Wrangler. And Cool Splash, far behind now, is Mouthpiece. They zip the opening quarter in 28 flat, and they move down the backstretch with Burglar dictating a lively pace. Windproof chasing second. Off the rail comes Tybalt. There goes Tybalt now driven hard to take the lead. There's a gap of almost four. Back to British Agent now, who's cutting into that gap. And on the outside, Hanover Knight, an uncovered sixth. Toward the rail, Rev it Up is racing seventh. And on the outside, it's Reuters, followed by Wrangler and Cool Splash as they reach the halfway point in 57 seconds flat, heading for the far turn. It's Tybalt on top. Burglar is racing second, followed by Windproof third. And the outside, Hanover Knight continues. First over Reuters, follows Hanover Knight. Down inside, it's British Agent now who's been shuffled back. On the outside, Wrangler around the far turn. Tybalt getting away now by two lengths. Burglar second on the inside. Hanover Knight right there third and toward the inside. Windproof is now fourth. It's still Tybalt showing the way into the lane. Burglar sits the pocket. Three quarters and one, 27 and two. It's Tybalt on top as they turn for home. Burglar chasing on the inside on the outside. Hanover Knight is now third. Then farther back it's Windproof toward the rail fourth and on the extreme outside Reuters is fifth. Coming down the lane and Tybalt is strong. Tybalt by two and a half. Burglar with one last move at the leader. Tybalt still there. Burglar coming hard. Can't get to him. Tybalt holds on by a measured length. Odds on choice wins it in 155 and two. And an early move by Campbell uh, gets the win here, Dave. Tybalt, that's two wins in a row now. This is a horse on a tear at this level. A 155 and two win certainly under wraps here. Indicates that he can keep on going very comfortably in this class. It's also another winner day for uh, trainer Russell France, who's having an excellent meet in terms of percentages. His UDRS figure is 341. Those are the kinds of numbers the batting average you normally see for a Steve Elliott or a Brett Pelling or a Joe Holloway. Russell picks up his 20th win of the meet here, and he's closing in on the training leaders. Tie ball. Uh, as Tom said, a measured length with Burglar finishing second, and in the photo, it was British agent third. The winner. Tie ball, $3.60, $3.260. Burglar, $4.320. British agent pays $5. The 1-4 exacta in the second, $16.40. We start the daily double with number one. 